make sure you watch this video to the end because in this video tutorial i'll be showing you on how you can now buy your turn through bybit exchange via p2p using your local bank account now after all this you can now be able to send that turn from your bybit exchange to your turn keeper wallet this is especially for those who are actually into all these airdrops that are being implemented by Tom. This way you can get your gas fee from there and you wouldn't want to or have to bother anyone else for gas fee. So let's get it. Open your Bybit app, okay? And then you click on more. Under buy crypto, you click on P2P trading. Now, if it's your first time using the P2P trading, you would see that it's in USDT okay which is usd so you simply click at the top of the usd here when you click on that you click on the search bar and you search for ngn okay you should see nigeria you put it as naira now you can see the real price if you want to perform the p2p transaction okay so when making your trade to buy make sure that you look for someone that you are eligible it's okay so one you can actually get to contact your trade and when scrolling if you can try making sure that you actually get to trade with verify merchants just like so okay now and also look out for merchants that has done over 800 trades or perhaps more trades than that 1000 2000 trades it's just for you to be safe while trying to conduct any kind of p2p all right so but first of all what you should actually do is to click on filter and then you put it on show only verified advertisers okay you do that you can also show um, only eligible ads as well and you click on confirm now you can see that you see you have people who are already verified up here all right but this might not actually get to help you make some trades because they are only going to show you verified merchants and most of them are not online and most times you are not eligible for them so in my case i'll just say that you just let it be the way it is so you can toggle around and get a merchant you can trade with all right so the amount we want to trade with let's say we'll click on amount let's say we want to trade for twelve thousand, or let's just make it thirteen thousand naira okay then you click on confirm now you can just scroll down and look for a merchant that you can actually get to buy your usdt from remember we are actually buying usdt as you can see this guy is not online okay always look out for these things look out for people that are online when they are online it takes green just like this okay and you can see a buy icon by the side so you just have to keep scrolling till you get or find someone like this guy has made over three thousand trades and he's online all right and he's selling he's selling within our range of thirteen thousand and above so you click on it you click on the ads and now you get to put in the amount you want to buy which is the 13k we talked about that is it and then you click on the buy icon now this thirteen thousand will give you eight dollar eight point zero two four seven dollar that's what you'll be getting so when you click on the buy it should take you to this page all right now you can see the buyer's info the seller's name you can see that this is verified as well and the details you need to pay into is when you get to click on pay now all right so you remember you have a countdown so your eyes should be on that as well so you need to make sure you make your payments early so he can be able to release the usdt to you so we click on pay now so when you click on pay now you should see a message that says please use your normal account details which bears the name of the same bybit accounts which probably you used your bvn for okay that's the same name the same account you're going to use to make this you know transaction and you can see the, the seller's name his account details and the account the bank account name as well okay so you simply click and copy the account details that's his account number and then you go over to your local bank account to make payments into his account before clicking payments com completed 
all right so let's just do that real quick to send the funds over to him and we'll get back to the video so i've made the payments so all i simply need to do right now is click on payments completed so they said the actual transfer amount you get to put that here sorry about that you click on i understand you click i confirm and then you click on confirm so we wait okay for him to release the funds now you can click on contact seller oh as you can see the order has been done already you don't need to confirm you don't need to contact him rather and then you can just simply click on done okay he released the crypto the usdt as you can see so you click on done and you can view my assets as you can see the eight dollar is in there now that we've gotten our usdt the next thing we need to do is to go and purchase stone okay so we go back to the home page all right now that we're here you click on spots and then you click on where it says turn yours, yours might not be turn usdt yours might be something else but click on it and you can search for it as the search bar here okay and once you've seen turn usdt you click on that what we need to do right now is to purchase but as you can see we don't have any available balance here so you click on that plus sign on that usdt there and then you have to click on transfer okay so as you can see our funds are in funding accounts and we need to move it down to spot accounts okay so what you simply need to do in this situation is to click on max and then you click on confirm so it has been transferred as you can see we now have an available balance here of eight dollars okay so what we simply need to do right now is click on this limit order and change it to market order so that you can buy it at the market price as it is instantly okay limit order is going to delay it's going to make sure it key in a particular order before you get to buy but market order will make you buy it instantly at the market price so what you need to do is to toggle this to the last which is max we are buying everything with the eight dollar and then you simply click on buy done order has been filled partially so we go over to assets now on the asset you scroll down and you click on spots now you can see that we actually do have ton here of eight dollar which is 1.5 ton okay now what we need to do is to transfer it from spots to funding okay so you click on transfer so we have our ton here which is in spot so we are transferring from spot to funding like i said and you click on max then you click on confirm it has been transferred so we go back as you can see the funds is now on funding okay now the next thing we need to do is transfer these funds which is the turn to our turn keeper all right that's where the problem is because we need turn in our turn keeper to receive most of these airdrops so you go over to your turn keeper you click on receive and then you copy the address you head back to your bybit app and then you click on withdraw you click on turn you paste in the address you just copied the network is done the memo there's no memo so just leave it there's optional now you screw down and you put it on funding then you click on max now you click on withdraw now you click on confirm you can click on no verification next time for this address but for tutorial reason i'm just going to leave it like that you click on confirm and it's asking me for verification which i'm going to get and impute here and get back right to the video so we confirm so the withdrawal have been submitted to our turn keeper now we just wait for it to arrive let's head over to the turn keeper to see if we've gotten the funds so we go back and you can see lo and behold the funds are here already so this is how you go about it this is how you can simply get Turn keeper from Bybee through your P2P. You're welcome. You know, pass like that. If $8 is not too small for you, then make sure you drop your turn keeper address in the comment section and I'll fund this to a lucky individual.
Now, in this video tutorial, you guys can actually get your turn. Turn, no be mana, you know, they fall from heaven. With the least 1000 naira or 2000 naira, you can actually get your turn from Bybit. And if you guys haven't actually signed up for Bybit, my Bybit link will be in the comment section and in the description of the video as well. You can use this link and sign up for Bybit so that you can actually get to trade. Now, when you sign up for Bybit, all you simply need to do is just to verify your KYC by using your VPN, which is very safe. Yes, once you're done with that, then you're good to go. That is the video and hopefully you guys get to enjoy it. And if you do like crypto content just like this, make sure to hit that link and follow. So that's it and see you on the next one.